Analog Devices ADXL 35X series of accelerometers are designed for applications like structural health monitoring, or SHM, and orientation and navigation. The series is comprised of the ADXL354, which has an analog output, and the ADXL355, which has a 20-bit ADC and a SPI interface. Now, there are a lot of accelerometers on the market today, so the question is what makes these noteworthy? And it's their noise performance, as well as their stability over time and temperature. And if you look at the accelerometers used in typical applications like your smartphone, they lack the combination of high resolution and ultra-low noise that allow you to measure your very small amplitude signals. They lack the stability and height offsets offered by the ADXL 35X series and required by applications like SHM and tilt sensing. And they also lack the industrial rated ceramic package and industrial temperature range that you need when you deploy to these applications. With SHM, your measurements are typically below 5 Hz and below half a G. And most accelerometers perform very poorly in these ranges. There have been studies done to determine whether or not smartphones could be used for SHM. And what they found was that you have up to a 50% amplitude error. And that highlights one of the key benefits of the ADXL 35X. Its noise density is spec'd at 25 microgs per root hertz, which is four to five times lower than what you'll find with consumer grade accelerometers. Now noise density is a factor that basically sets a floor on the signal amplitude you can measure. In fact, with the ADXL 35X, you can measure below one milliG at its full bandwidth, and you can measure even lower as you decrease your measurement bandwidth. Another key aspect for these applications is stability over time and temperature and the ADXL 35X delivers on both. It has a low zero-g offset of plus or minus 25 millig's and a low zero-g drift of plus or minus three and a half millig's, and that's rated for 10 years. It also has a temperature sensitivity rating of 0.1% per degree C, meaning that over the entire negative 40 to positive 105 degree C temperature range, there will be very minimal measurement variation, and there's a temperature sensor output on the device so you can correct for it. The devices also offer very low power operation and standby modes, which is critical for battery-powered applications like inclinometers or wireless sensor networks used in SHM. For more info, components, and eval boards for the analog devices ADXL 35X series accelerometers, visit mauser.com.